Iceland, an island of fire and ice, has become one of the world's top travel destinations, not only for thrill-seeking adventurers but also for nature lovers looking for something different. In this video, you'll discover Iceland's active volcanoes, geysers, hot springs, glaciers, ice fields, and fjords, making it an interesting country to visit. On this sparsely populated country, resting at the edge of the Arctic Circle that sits atop one of the world's most volcanically active areas, is just one of the most interesting activities each traveler can ever have. Indeed, volcanoes and other seismic activity have regularly reshaped parts of the country. As a result, the air is wonderfully clean, and the rugged, unspoiled landscapes remain ripe for exploration and unforgettable adventures. So we are here to help you choose the best places to visit in Iceland. But before we continue, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to press the bell icon. So you don't miss any important updates. Let's get started. Number 1. Reykjavik no matter when you plan to travel, whale watching happens year-round, although summer is the most popular time to see these gentle giants. During the warmer months, trips run day and night, including whale watching in the midnight sun. Tour operators say there's an 80 to 95 percent chance of seeing these magnificent creatures, depending on the time of year. Best of all, surfacing often happens near the boats so you may enjoy a ringside seat for one of nature's most awe-inspiring spectacles. Other ocean-going tours are also available, such as birdwatching and island visits. Tours are convenient since there are several types available, and they depart from Reykjavik's old harbor. Stop for a dinner of fresh cod after you return in one of the many small, rustic restaurants located in the harbor area. Number 2. Grindavik. This most iconic of geothermal spas is a must-see tourist attraction. Here, you'll find natural bathing in pale blue water in the shadow of a power station. An entire blue lagoon industry has grown around this attraction since it first became a hit with locals in 1976. The water from the underground hot springs reaches 37 to 39 degrees Celsius and is said to be highly beneficial for both health and skin. If the die-hard Icelanders are anything to go by, don't knock the theory. Aside from bathing in a unique setting, there's a shop selling skincare products, a range of spa treatments, and places to eat and drink. Don't visit Iceland without coming here. Number 3. Spectacular Geysers Strakker Geyser is the most popular fountain geyser in the country and is famed throughout the world. This highly active hot spring area lies in the southwest of Iceland beside the Hvida River and is a favorite stop along what's known as the Golden Circle. Boiling mud pits and around 100 other smaller exploding geysers are waiting to be explored here. Every few minutes, Strocker shoots water 30 meters into the air. Visit the Geyser Center for exhibits and informative presentations year-round. Number 4. Aurora Borealis the Northern Lights, or Aurora Borealis, are among the most popular tourist attractions in Iceland. Auroras are linked to the solar wind, a flow of ions radiating from the sun. These particles become ensnared in the Earth's magnetic field and collide with atmospheric molecules, causing bursts of energy, which appear as large circles around the poles. This spectacular natural light show is best admired in remote places and is particularly impressive at times of increased solar activity. Number 5. Land Manilagar Nature Reserve Land Manilagar National Park is one of Iceland's most popular tourist destinations. The main features of this mystical landscape are the multi-hued rhyolite mountains, the Hekla volcano, and extensive lava fields. Hiking and horse riding are popular things to do here and hikes range from a couple of hours to several days. You can visit from June to late September, after which the road is closed. A mountain lodge, Landmanilagar Hut, with basic facilities accommodates 75 people. Expect raw nature, rugged scenery, and utterly spectacular views. Number 6. Malafell Volcano and Myrtlesjokull Glacier Park South of Landmanilagar lies Myrtlesjokull Glacier Park, which for safety reasons can only be visited during summer. Large amounts of rain soak the area, particularly in winter, when roads can be severely damaged. Malafell Volcano is the undisputed jewel in the crown of this wild, rugged glacial landscape. 
The perfect cone shape gives Malafell the look of a classic volcano. However, during the warm season, a lavish green covering of moss gives it a surreal, otherworldly appearance. Number 7. Skaftafell Ice Cave, Vatnajökull National Park In the south of the country, Vatnajökull National Park is a land of glaciers and magnificent ice caves, which attract adventurers from across the globe. The vast national park is divided into four sections and consists of the Vatnajökull Glacier and its surroundings. You'll find several visitor centers, those in Skaftafell Ice Cave and Hofn are open year-round, while Skryu Kloster and Jokulsarveljufer are closed in winter. The best time to visit Skaftafell Ice Cave is during winter after heavy rain has washed away the top layer of the glacier. Number 8. Askja Caldera In the northern region of Vatnajökull National Park, Askja Caldera and the geothermal pool in the Dingjifjaw Mountains are not one for the faint-hearted. However, if you'd like to say you've taken a dip in a live volcano, then this is for you. Askja is an impressive 50 square kilometers in size. The surrounding mountain range was formed during volcanic activity, and Askja was partly created by an eruption of burning ash that collapsed the roof of the central volcano's magma chamber. The water in Vidi, the geothermal pool and volcanic crater, is generally around 30 degrees Celsius. A word of warning, the banks can be very slippery, particularly in wet weather. Number 9. Dedafoss Waterfall Dedafoss, in the north of Vatnajökull National Park, truly is a breathtaking example of the raw power of nature. Plunging 45 meters and with a width of 100 meters, it's said to be the most powerful waterfall in Europe. Generally, it's best to approach the east side of the river Jokulsa, where the road is better. Number 10, Kirkjafell Mountain, Grundrfjordr. A charming fishing village centrally located on the north coast of the Snæfellsnes Peninsula. The town lies in a picturesque fjord, surrounded by mountains, Kirkjafell looming as a striking landmark. Dotted about the surroundings, you'll discover small streams and waterfalls. During winter, Kirkjafell is a great place to watch the awe-inspiring northern lights. Irbigja Heritage Center holds exhibitions on Grundrfjordr's seafaring history and is the information center for the whole peninsula. Number 11, Halgrimskirkja. This visually striking church is one of Iceland's top attractions, and when you see it, you'll understand why. It's the tallest and most recognizable building in the country. The Black Falls, a basalt rock formation, which is one of Iceland's natural wonders, inspired the architectural design. A climb to the top of the 73-meter-high tower is particularly rewarding. You'll be treated to spectacular views across the city and surrounding landscape here. At the front of the church is a statue of islander Leifur Eriksson, Leif the Lucky, the first European to discover America around AD 1000. It seems he beat Christopher Columbus by around 500 years or so. Number 12. Gullfoss Waterfall magnificent Gullfoss waterfall lies around a 90-minute drive west of Reykjavik. The river Hvida plummets into a canyon, which forms three-step terraces, creating a powerful torrent. Gullfoss encompasses two cascades, the upper one drops 11 meters, while the lower one cascades about 21 meters. Number 13, Town of Akureyri. In the north of the country, Akureyri lies amid mountains on the longest fjord in Iceland, about 40 kilometers south of the Arctic Circle. With a population of around 18,000, it's more of a town than a city, however, everything's relative in this sparsely populated land. Summer days occasionally reach 25 degrees Celsius, and although winters bring heavy snowfall and cold weather, calm and still weather generally prevails. Number 14, Lake Myven and Nature Reserve. It is a lake district famous for its wealth of bird life, rich fauna, and large shallow body of water. It's estimated that the area was formed around 2,500 years ago by a gigantic lava eruption. Today, the surroundings are volcanically active, with an eruption occurring as recently as the mid-1980s. Bubbling clay pits, sulfuric fumes, and lava formations all form part of this unique landscape, which is still in flux. Number 15, the Pearl Observatory. Originally the site of the city's gigantic thermal water tanks, Perlon, as it's known locally, is one of Reykjavik's landmark buildings. 
It occupies an enviable location on Skjul Hill, with more than 176,000 trees. The hill is particularly pleasant, with bicycle trails and footpaths zigzagging up and down. The observatory affords stunning views over the city. Also on site is a revolving restaurant and gourmet and souvenir shops. So, have you decided where you will go in Iceland for your next trip? Tell us in the comments below. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. So you don't miss out on awesome content like this. We will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.